hello everyone welcome to tech tuxedo in our previous videos we spoke about three basic user files which are etc past wd file etc group file and it is a share file and then we showed you our user add command to add user and how these three files are updated when we use user add command but what if we don't have user add command uh, do you think it is possible to add a user if there is no user related commands i would say yes and in this video i will show you how to add user without user add command so first we will add our user in this file so we're going to go in bottom we going to give our username a name let's call it tech tuxedo 555 we we have to give him a user id we we'll, let's give it 999 in group id of 999 give any comment this is without user id give the this user a home directory slash home slash so, tech tuxedo 555 in a shell bin bash and cool okay now let's go to this direct let's create this directory mkdir mkdir to create a directory let's go to this directory home So home is currently owned by root. We have to change this ch own to tech taxi to five five five. Any directory name and group should need to change group as well. Change group. My bad. Okay. It's saying invalid group because it's not there. It's not added. Let me just quickly add it to etc group file in the bottom x, and the group ID was nine nine nine. It's there. Now we will run our command and should run, and you will see the home directory is there. Now to our final file, etc shadow. Even if we don't add our um, user to this file, still it should work. So if I uh, do switch directory to this user, see, I'm there. So I'm in the home directory, and I've got. this shell you see id it's got the gid and the group and everything so the user is there but for for from people who want to access into system into this system who are not root owned they won't be able to log in because we have not done uh, the user entry in shadow file so we're going to add it shadow file now was changing permission because it was read only now we're going to go to the bottom and the username tech taxido 555 so user still need to be password to be set this you can give 
anything you like. So I'm just gonna copy paste and done. Now we're gonna do a passwd command to change password for this user. Let's give it a good password. Now if you see our etc passwd file, it's there. Sorry, etc shadow file. It's there. And if we switch to this user, it should work like a normal user. There won't be any difference in this user or the user we created using user head command. They both will act the same and Linux will never know or the uh, other users will never know how this user was created. Hope you enjoyed this video. So This was basically a tutorial where you don't have the user at command but you wanted to add user and it was uh, more in depth about these three files and how these three files work and basically how user add command is working in these three files. Hope you enjoyed this video. Keep watching our channel for more such videos. Thank you. And please uh, put in your comments if you feel something was missed in the video. If you feel uh, I need to improve something, please put your comments. Your comments are valuable. Thank you.